Eustinopteron is a genus of prehistoric sarcoptrygian which has attained an iconic status from its close relationships to tetrapods. Early depictions of this animal show it emerging onto land, however paleontologists now widely agree that it was a strictly aquatic animal. The genus Eustinopteron is known from several species that lived during the late Devonian period, about 380. 85 million years ago. Eustinopteron was first described by J. F. Witteves in 1881, as part of a large collection of fishes from Miguasha, Quebec. Some 2,000 Eustinopteron specimens have been collected from Miguasha, one of which was the object of intensely detailed study in several papers from the 1940s to the 1990s by paleoichthyologist Eric Jarvik. Description Anatomically, Eustinopteron shares many unique features in common with the earliest known tetrapods. Largest individuals grew up to 1.8 meters in length. It shares a similar pattern of skull roofing bones with forms such as Ichthyostega and Acanthostega. Eustinopteron, like other tetrapodomorph fishes, had internal nostrils, which were one of the defining traits of tetrapodomorphs. It also had labyrinthodont teeth, characterized by infolded enamel, which characterizes all of the earliest known tetrapods as well. Like other fish like Sarcoptrygians, Eustinopteron possessed a two part cranium, which hinged at mid length along an intracranial joint. Eustinopteron's notoriety comes from the pattern of its fin endoskeleton, which bears a distinct humerus, ulna, and radius and femur, tibia, and fibula. These appendicular long bones had epiphyseal growth plates that allowed substantial longitudinal growth through endochondral ossification. As in tetrapod long bones, these six appendicular bones also occur in tetrapods and are a synapomorphy of a large clade of sarcoptrygians, possibly tetrapodomorpha. Similarly, its elasmoid scales lack superficial odontodes composed of dentine and enamel. This loss appears to be a synapomorphy with more crownwood tetrapodomorphs. The earliest known fossilized evidence of bone marrow has been found in Eustinopteron, which may be the origin of bone marrow in tetrapods. Eustinopteron differs significantly from some later carboniferous tetrapods in the apparent absence of a recognized larval stage and a definitive metamorphosis. In even the smallest known specimen of Eustinopteron 40, the Lepidotrichia cover all of the fins, which does not happen until after metamorphosis in general like polyodon. This might indicate that Eustinopteron developed directly with the hatchling already attaining the general body form of the adult. In popular culture, Eustinopteron is featured in the second episode of Animal Armageddon, in textbooks as a missing link between fish and tetrapods with other ancient fish in the movie Ponyo.